Tell us about what exactly a quasar is and what are the the models that you're developing? What exactly are they trying to extract from them? Mm. Okay, so the quasar from quasi-stellar radio source, we now know that the supermassive black holes in the centers of galaxies. Every galaxy has one of these supermassive black holes, millions to billions of suns worth of mass. Normally quiet, the Milky Way zone SMBH is, is quiet, um, but sometimes something happens, gas gets pushed to the center of the galaxy, it ends up falling into a, a whirlpool, an accretion disk, spilling into the black hole where it heats just, just through friction, turning this gravitational potential energy into heat, and they radiate, and they can radiate you know, a thousand times brighter than the galaxy that they're in. Even though they're small, you know, the galaxy is hundreds of billions of stars, solar systems. This thing is the size of a single solar system in the very center of a galaxy. But we see them to the ends of the universe. They're, they're that bright. Like the heat glow of this accretion disk is just insane. Uh, you know, when we first saw these things in surveys we were doing of the sky in the early part of the 20th century, you know, there were these points of light with a, a radio blob around them and we had no idea what they were. So they're outshining their galaxies in they're some cases. vastly yeah. outshining their galaxies in most cases. When you can see the accretion disk, they very much are. And all sorts of violent processes are going. You've got the, the whirlpool of the accretion disk, then you've got gas being blasted out, orbiting around, producing all sorts of different observable signatures in this point of light. And when you take the spectrum of the point of light, you see this heat glow, but you see this these gigantic emission lines from different atoms that are being ionized and, and moving at massive speeds. So you've got this crazy Doppler broadening. These were very confusing and they're also very far away. So they're, they're reddened by the expanding universe. 